Hello, hello, Kristen here. So today I'm gonna to be getting ready to go to wrestling. We're going, I think it's Freelance Underground or is it Freelance Wrestling? Either way, it's Freelance and the big show is going to be Project Monix versus Matt Nix. Matt Nix has not wrestled in, I think six months he said, and then Project Monix uh, through this whole swerve thing. And I'm pretty sure, of course, he was trying to do this much earlier than right now, but basically he turned heel. And it was uh, over a long, long time, and he made everyone think that he was actually um, quitting wrestling due to injury. Uh, and instead, he became heel. And it was amazing, actually. So, very excited to to see this uh, see this happen, see what happens here at the show. Uh, we're actually bringing our friend Donnie with, so that's cool. Anyways, my name is Kristen. I'm a daily uploader. I'm uploading until February 5th next year, which is when I turn 40 years old. I said I'm going to do a year of daily uploads, and I have two months left. I'm so ready to be done with it. After this, I'm going to go to probably three days a week. Anyways, that's besides the point. Today, I'm just going to get ready to go to this wrestling event. And I don't have a plan. I was really happy, though, I found my Natasha Denona. Natasha Denona, what is wrong with me? ABH. <laughs> my ABH eye primer. I think I must have just watched it on that video or something. Anyways, yes. So, going to get ready to go. What am I going to use? I have no idea. I cleaned a lot of my room yesterday. And I'm trying to organize it in a more logical fashion and in a way that will make me use what I own. So all of my palettes are actually <laughs> right here next to me. And then I have all my face products in these like upright drawers, which are all this way, um, so that they'll all be together, which is nice too. Uh, I have new stuff. Ooh, I don't know what that was. I have new stuff over here. Um, I think I'm just going to grab a random palette from the old pile, the old pile, the old stuff. And this is probably going to be an unedited video, just so you know. And yeah, 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 yeah. So very excited wrestling. Not excited to go back to work on Monday, but what can you do? I, I'm not, definitely not using that. I thought about using, what did I think about using? I don't even know now. <laughs> no. What's this? No. What is this? Ooh. No. <laughs> I don't know what I want to use. I do have a lot of stuff over here. Maybe I should use, in honor of going to wrestling, the Beat House Cosmetics. This palette? It's a huge palette to choose from, for sure. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a terrible person. I don't know what I want to do. I just want to get some makeup on my freaking face, man. Like, what's this? This isn't necessarily new. Oh, this is blue. I don't know if I want to do blue. What about this? This is my Alien Cosmetics now, Unearthly Cosmetics. I think I'm going to use that because I haven't like actually really used this palette. So, yes, this is the color story we're working with. This is the uh, Sydney Nicole, right? Yeah, the Alien Cosmetics and Sydney Nicole palette. There we go. All right. Unedited video, y'all. Unedited video, y'all. Yeah, so, anyways, I did a lot of cleaning. I stayed up really late last night, but that's okay, because, like, I want to be able to come into my room and just say, I'm going to do my makeup. And also, I'm going to record a video. <laughs> because, because, why would I not want to? You know, it's a very tiny area, and if you've, you know, been subscribed, you know what it looks like, I, I think. I've shown it, not, like, extensively or anything, but I have shown it on video. It's a small little room. It used to be... I guess it used to be like an all seasons room, um, but the people that originally built the house, they like bricked up the windows, the big huge windows. They had like bay windows basically on all three sides. And it has French doors leading down into it. But uh, yeah, they bricked it up. The, the people we bought the house from, they were only the second owners. They said, they said they were told that they bricked it up because the train tracks across the street there used to be like 13 of them, and somehow it turned up into Hobo City, so that's why, I don't know. That, that's why they said they bricked up the windows. I don't know if that's true or not. It's still a funny story, though. Yeah, anyways. Uh, I have a lot of brushes here. I have, I found a lot of brushes. Hmm. 
Yes. Okay, I don't know if you can hear that. My microphone's right here on the table. I'm wiping my brush off in the color switch. And of course I don't have one of my mirrors that's over there because I put them all together. But I have a mirror across the table for me and I got this mirror in the palette here. So I think um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and do Pale and Mysterious first. Or should it? No, I'm going to do Unpleasant Dreams, this lilac -y, light lilac -y purple. I haven't really used this palette yet. All right. Let's see what happens. And I have super hooded eyes. Maybe I should bring you in a little bit. Yeah. Come on. There we go. I, <laughs> oops. Boo. Excuse me. I have my camera actually on my ring light stand. I found the little thingy. I don't know what you call it. But it's the little thing that attaches the camera or whatever to, to the ring light. So that's kind of cool. I'm very nasally today. Uh, I think it's from, I think it's from the cleaning. There's so much. I don't want to say there's so much dust in here, but like it was dusty. Like you, you know when you're cleaning and it's dusty and like you can taste it in your mouth. Yeah, that's what it was like. All right, I'm gonna wing this out too. We do have to wear masks. We're going into Illinois now. I will say, the last show that me and my husband went to it was in Illinois. It was at a, um, a restaurant bar, a huge fuck off place, Bourbon Street. Huge fuck off place. Now Illinois, all of Illinois still has a mask mandate, but like, even the people working there weren't wearing masks. Now. I'm not saying I'm going to be like the person I'm going to tell on them or anything, but like, I imagine that they could get fined. I don't know. I don't know how that works. I'm just like, well, at my work, it's federally mandated. So like I could get fired if I don't wear my, I don't know about random ass bars, but whatever. Uh, well, this is a nice color. I went on. Uh, probably would have looked a little bit better if I used, like, a white base. But that's cool. Yeah. Nice little color. Nice little color. Okay. Maybe a different brush here. Yeah, I'm so glad I found a lot of these other brushes. All right. Good enough. Okay, so now, so that was the next, so this is that, oh, there we go. There's that, that lilac-y purple color. Now the next colors are pretty dark, actually. There's not really like a next, next light up. So we got, we got these three colors right here that I think would look really good with them. So I think I'm going to do Unhappy Darling. There we go. Yeah, I think that'll pair well with it. Did I choose the wrong brush? I don't know. Guess we will see. Yep, so we're bringing our friend Donnie, so that's nice too. We know Donnie through Rocky Horror. Um, I actually, he's the one I actually gave my old car to as well. When I, when my previous Jeep got totaled, we were at a wrestling show. Um, <laughs> basically. Basically, we were at a wrestling show in Berwyn, Illinois. Berwyn. <laughs> Berwyn, freaking Illinois. And I don't know what they do out there, but, like, you know, if something happened, like, out here, you know, the police would, like, go to the local, whatever, establishments or whatever businesses are on the street 
and say, hey, we got some cars, her, <laughs> uh, that have been hit. And anyways, it didn't happen. So when we walked out of the show, it was like that movie, Dude, Where's My Car? We're like, where's the Jeep? <laughs> we saw police on, uh, police on the street with their lights still going like around where the car was. And we we're like, oh, no. And yeah, so anyways, long story short, <laughs> I ended up with a new Jeep. Orange color this time. Previous one was blue. Happy with it. It's the Jeep, um... Oh my god, I'm having a brain fart. Jeep Renegade. Jeep Renegade Trailhawk. Well, that's a nice color combination, I think. Yeah. So something I saw another YouTuber do, um, she would tap off the excess on her hand, actually, instead of, like, going like that. And, I mean, this is only my first time doing that, but it seems to be working cool. Yeah. All right, so I'm just going to take that same color on this brush since I'm using it, and I'm going to put it under my lash line. Am I going to do a full face? I don't know, but if I do, I'll let you know. Unsure right now. I've also decided that I will do a giveaway soon. I will do a giveaway soon, but I'm not going to like announce it or anything. I'm going to, it's going to be hidden inside of a video. So if you, and I just basically, I want it to be for the people who actually watch my videos. Uh, I don't, you know, there, there are people that show up just for giveaways and like, I'm sorry, but I want, I want, I want to thank the people who actually watch me because you take time out of your day to watch little old me who doesn't matter at all. I'm just doing this for fun and to be able to connect with people because, hey, I don't have any really good real friends in real life and it kind of sucks. I've been online uh, a lot of my life, actually, even though I'm going to be 40 soon. I, I've been playing on the internet since before it was the internet as we know it today, when it was just bulletin boards. I was very tiny. I was a, 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 a young little person, and my dad would give me 30 minutes to play on his black and white laptop. Because they didn't really come in color back then. But, uh, yeah, he would let me play on Prodigy and Bulletin boards and, uh, you know, kind of chat with people that way. So that was interesting. So I've, I've seen the internet evolve and, man, I missed out on some trends. This account is actually, I created in 2007. Can you imagine if I had started making videos back then? I would have millions of followers. Damn it! Why didn't I do that? And then also Bitcoin. I was there... Not there, but, you know, like, when it was first created, I was like, no, that's a fucking scam. <laughs> oh, man, I could have had. Mm. Oh, well. All right, so this blend is really cool. I, I like the I like the look. I'm glad I use this. This is awesome. I'm just going to use the same brush, go back into the original color. That was Unpleasant Dreams. I don't know if I said that before. And just uh, kind of blend it. Bring it out a little bit. My my left eye, what you see on the right, is always the better one. I don't know why. I really, you know, whenever I'm doing makeup or anything, it just always looks better. Not fair. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Okay, so... Alright, what am I going to do next? I'm going to take another tiny brush and knock an even tinier one on the floor. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to take Unpleasant Dreams on this tiny brush and put it underneath my eyes here on the inner area. Eh, I probably should have tried to match my shirt, but that's okay. I'm wearing a Danhausen shirt. He's not going to be there or anything, but... It's like one of the wrestling shirts that I just had right there. 
All right, just kind of blended that in with the other one. I'm actually going to take I'm going to take some of the darkest one though that I see in here. Um, I don't know. So movie massacre or sans weather, but this one's kind of greenish blue. So I'm going to use this one because it's kind of pur purpley blue. And just very lightly on this little tiny brush, tap it off on my hand, and we're going to use this on the outer outer corner and kind of waterline just to deepen it up. I might use this on the outer corner of my actual eyelids too. I just wanted to see what it, it would look like blended together. Yeah, it looks nice. Again, looks a little better on my, my left eye. Hilarious. Okay. But I'm not going to use that. Should I use that one? Yeah, I'll try and use that one. I don't know if that'll work very well because it is a tiny, 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 tiny brush. Alright. That's cool. And I don't know if I should use like a tacky base. Because uh, I want to use some of these shimmers. I might just try and go with the flat brush and see how it works without like the glitter glue. Because like honestly, you know, they should design this stuff to not have to use other products. Let's see. Let's see if my husband's texting me at all. Nope. Mm -mm. Okay, cool. All right, good to go, good to go. I almost thought I didn't make a video yesterday too. I was like, oh shit, I broke my streak, but no, <laughs> that didn't happen. I was just being silly. All I did was I uploaded a short basically saying I was cleaning, but man, I got so much junk out of my bathroom though. That was a big thing. Okay, so. These are mostly mattes. Now we do have Glamour Ghoul, but it's a green with like glitter like inside. It kind of reminds me of like Color Pops stuff that does that. But we do have um, this Elvira and this Lily. And these are very nice. Uh, so the Lily, is, uh, excuse me, Elvira is pink and Lily is like a greeny. I don't even know how well these will show up on camera. I got them, got them right there. Probably a dumb place to put them on my hand. <laughs> They're both very nice and probably sheer too. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna do Elvira because that will match. Now, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what this is gonna look like here. Oh, okay. Never mind. It's nice. So I can do this on my lid and then maybe use the lily one as my inner corner. How about that? I think with the glitter glue it probably would have laid down nicer, but that's okay. Is what it is. Maybe I should have wet the brush. That's okay. I know for next time. But yeah, this is very nice. This is a nice palette so far. The mattes blended out beautifully. I think this was my first palette from Alien Cosmetics, now Unearthly Cosmetics. I do believe that I don't know if they got sued necessarily, but I, I'm pretty sure they got sent a cease and desist by whoever makes the Alien Perfume. Now, I don't think anyone is going to confuse Alien Perfume with an indie makeup brand, so fuck whoever makes... Fuck whoever makes the Alien Perfume. Some people say, well, they should have done their homework to see, you know, blah, 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 and I'm like... They probably did. They saw that no one had a, a patent or whatever, a 
I don't know what you call it. Whatever. You know what I'm talking about. A thing on Alien Cosmetics. And Alien Perfume is just freaking perfume. So they can go fuck themselves, in my opinion. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to take this first brush. And I'm going to take uh, some of the Unhappy Darling, which is the... That one. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah. And I'm just going to try and kind of deepen up this outer area. Bring it out a little bit. Ooh, I'm hungry. So also kind of cool too, uh, I've met some people not in real life. <laughs> I found some people on like Instagram and not not Twitter, I think just Instagram, but people I've seen at shows or like just discovered, you know, each other because of, uh, you know, liking wrestling and Instagram. And uh, two of the people I've discovered uh, are local in Chicago and they go to a lot of the same shows. So that's kind of cool. We haven't like really talked extensively with a whole lot of people that go to the shows that we go to. So, uh, one person, her name, I think, I think her pronoun is her. I'm not sure. I didn't ask. I feel bad, but her name is Danielle. Of course, if she tells me differently, I will, of course, call her by whatever she wants. But I, I think, I think for right now it's, it's her. Anyways, just, just going by, by name. So I'll see you later. It's cool. Um, but yeah, she's going to the same show tonight. So that's awesome. So I'll get to say hi. I've seen her a lot at the shows and I, I always recognize her because I see her awesome makeup. She wears really, really cool makeup. Okay, so I'm not like wowed by this, by the shimmer at least, but I think again that's because it either needs to be on top of a glitter glue and or um, sprayed. Sprayed what? That's okay. I am totally not mad at it. So I'm going to take an even smaller brush and we're going to do Lily in the inner corner. I do definitely, ooh, ooh, okay, yes, that is very nice. I, I do want to do like a low buy video for next year. Um, I've been on a low buy unofficially. I've kind of mentioned it in a video here or there. But basically I'm just taking like my tip money if I buy something and I'm not even like spending all my, my money on makeup or anything. But uh, I will say I did use tip money to get this mystery box from Melt Cosmetics and boy am I disappointed in the shit that was in that. It was a $75 one. Yeah, I'm... I'm... Mm, like, I, I thought, oh, that's what I'm going to do today because I, I I got it in today. I'm like, oh, I will use the stuff in there. No. No, I'm probably... I'm so disappointed. Anyways. All right. Uh, because I put stuff away, I do need to grab products to do my face. So, unfortunately... Fuck. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't just let it be an unedited video because I got to go grab shit. Okay, I'll be right back. There we go. Okay, so this is the completed look. I'm not doing any more makeup. Okay, <laughs> not doing any more makeup. Um, okay, so hauntingly glamorous. So not really a review because I haven't really used it enough to warrant a review. But it was nice. Uh, the mattes were nice. The shimmers... I think next time I'm definitely going to have to put down a uh, glitter primer or maybe even turn it into like a, uh, a liquid using this little bottle of stuff and I forget what it's called but it's basically you mix it with your eyeshadow and it kind of makes it liquidy. So I'm probably going to find something more glitterly, glitter, gl glitterly, oh god I can't speak. Um, anyways, more glittery to put on my lids. Uh, just give it some more oomph because like I feel like it's lacking it. Other than that, I did uh, my eyelashes actually with a different mascara this time. The big poppy 
from Wet n Wild. And then for my, I did do wings. I also did my inner corners. The a little differently though, where you're doing the the little point in it. Except I'm not doing it on the upper. I'm just doing it on the lower. I'm looking in the viewfinder here. Uh, just doing in the lower area, and I didn't do it as big as last time, and um, I'm actually really digging the look. I think I think it kind of helps elongate my eyes. doesn't necessarily help them look bigger, I don't think. And then, but yeah, I did the wings on the back. So I did use this. This is an Ulta Beauty collab. This is with Marvel or something, or... Yeah, WandaVision. So this is a stamp for each each side of the eye. It's a, it's a wing. Yeah, anyways, you got one for each side because they're kind of swoopy. Swoopy. Yes. So that's about all I did. Uh, brow product, which I still need to do an unboxing for, something that I got a long, long time ago, which was a, uh, a Juvia's Place mystery box. And this is one of the things in it is a brow, brow pencil. So I just did that. I'm not doing anything else. Like I said, I have to wear masks, so um, I'm done with that. But uh, yeah, so uh, thank you for being here. I do really appreciate it. Uh, again, watch out for a secret giveaway and another video coming soon. I am going to do the Melt unboxing probably tomorrow. We'll see what happens. And yeah, I go back to work on Monday. So thank you so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed this little Get Ready With Me style video. And I will see you tomorrow, daily uploader, don't forget. I can't wait for it to be over. Why did I choose to do that? Ugh. I blame the big YouTubers that, that have done it. Anyways, <laughs> too much of me. I will see you tomorrow. Talk to you later, bye.